quick drop a like in the next five seconds if you don't want to wait an extra three weeks to unlock the deadpool skin we get five subscribers every single day here on home of games so if you want to receive a gift be sure you hit that subscribe button and if you do hit that subscribe button you will be our three million subscriber Welcome back everybody to home of games today. We have some rather unfortunate news about the Deadpool challenges here inside of Fortnite We were all very very excited to finally unlock the Deadpool skin next week on week 7 After so long of grinding each and every week making sure we complete the challenges and normally Earning a not so cool reward like the loading screen we have gotten some super awesome rewards like the backbling katana and other awesome stuff like that but let's be honest those are all just kind of stops on the way to our final destination that we were all waiting for being the deadpool skin and with the release of the 12.20 update that came out last week that added the helicopters we even saw the deadpool skin featured inside of one of those little fortnite shorts that epic games always post to the fortnite youtube channel inside of this little trailer you could see the deadpool skin doing in the cartwheel and emote and in this trailer it also revealed the oro skin we also saw the oro skin come into the item shop yesterday at 8 a.m in the morning now we normally don't see the item shop change at that time ever but the reason it actually changed at 8 a.m and the oro skin was released then was because at that exact same time we received the brand new totally free awaken oro challenges while the oro skin inside of the item shop does cost 2000 v bucks being one of the more expensive skins inside of fortnite the challenge set is totally free for everyone and you don't even have to own the battle pass through this challenge set you get a beautiful 400,000 xp a free gilded scepter pickaxe as well as a golden wrap all for totally free now at the time i'm recording this there are only four days left to complete the challenges after these four days you will never ever be able to complete these challenges and earn these rewards ever again so complete them while you still can also if you decide to pick up that absolutely incredibly beautiful oro skin from the fortnite item shop feel free to use our supported creator code homa games we're an official epic partner and all of your guys to support through the item shop makes all the giveaways and everything we do here on the channel possible you should also be seeing the brand new contract giller bundle being added to the item shop any day now players in australia started seeing this pack show up in their item shop yesterday meaning that it's going to roll out to the rest of the world throughout the next 24 hours the contract giller bundle will not only give you the contract giller skin it will also give you a baby fish stick back bling as well as another challenge set and for from each challenge you complete you're gonna earn 100 v bucks on your account there will be a total of 10 challenges meaning that you are able to earn a total of 1000 v bucks and since the bundle is only ten dollars to begin with i think that is a pretty darn good deal now that is no doubt a lot of new stuff just added into fortnite especially in the terms of challenges we got the awaken oro challenges yesterday we got the brand new weekly battle pass challenges today and we're also seeing the contract giller challenges added to the item shop sometime today as well and all of that is actually the reason for this video epic games may actually be delaying the deadpool weekly challenges due to all of the content that they're flooding the game with at the current moment and the major situation that's going on in the world right now as many of you know over the last two weeks we've seen a timer display on the little computer for the deadpool challenges that says the new challenges won't be coming out at this point for another seven and a half days now at first we all just thought that this timer saying it was going to be weeks until we got the next deadpool challenges was only a visual glitch and that it was counting down to nothing and epic games had just made a little oopsie and the timer didn't mean anything this was further confirmed last week when it said the week five challenges weren't supposed to come out for another 14 days but they ended
ended up releasing anyways last Friday. So that right there makes a lot of sense, right? If the timer says it was gonna come out in 14 days and it ended up coming out way, way sooner, it's clearly just a visual glitch, right? Well, at this point, I honestly don't know. Ever since we first saw this glitch appear and the timer starting to display insanely high times before the next challenge set is released, Epic Games has released a total of two new maintenance patches for Fortnite. Now, if you don't know what a maintenance patch is, it's basically an update for the game, but instead of adding a bunch of new cosmetics and new challenges and stuff like that, it's just an update that purely fixes any glitches or bugs that they added by accident. So after two of these brand new maintenance updates, there has been no change to the timer inside of the Deadpool Weekly Challenges whatsoever. This is clearly very, very concerning because it seems like a very important bug that Epic Games would want to fix pretty quickly. I've also seen a ton of people in the Fortnite community discussing this, and it's no doubt been brought to Epic Games' attention at least one time, but for some reason, that timer still says one week until we receive the new challenges. But there is a glimmer of hope out there for us that we could still be getting the Deadpool skin on week 7 and not have it be delayed by a week or even two weeks. And this little piece of hope is actually the calendar that is hanging above the little toilet in Deadpool's room. So if you haven't seen the calendar yet, first off, what are you doing, man? You gotta be checking Deadpool's room every single day. It's the first thing I do every day when I wake up, no matter what. But on this calendar, each and every single day, whenever the item shop rotates, another black X will be added over another day on the calendar. This will obviously happen each and every single day, leading up to the very last day, which has a red circle on it, and that day is supposedly April 3rd. Now, obviously, since this calendar has a little picture of Deadpool on it, we can only assume that this calendar is actually counting down to the day when the Deadpool skin is going to be unlocked. And assuming we unlock the Deadpool skin on week 7 and not week 6, this calendar is our only real hope that the Deadpool challenges haven't been delayed, because if it was delayed, that red circle would be removed. Now, other than Epic Games not fixing this glitch at all in two new maintenance updates, they haven't made any comment on this issue at all on any of their Twitter accounts. But rest assured, as soon as they do, I'll be sure to break the news to you guys on here. Also, make sure you go subscribe to the official second channel of Home of Games, Home of Games 2, where I'll also break the latest news and updates. But whether or not the Deadpool challenges come out in week 6 or week 7, one thing is for sure. We already know what the week 6 challenges are going to be, as well as the reward as well. The first challenge will be relatively easy, and all you will have to do is locate Deadpool's big black marker somewhere around the Battle Pass HQ. We're not 100% sure where this location is going to be, but like I said, if the challenges do end up releasing tomorrow morning, I'll have a video out on Home of Games 2 showing you guys exactly where this big black marker is located. But for the second challenge, you're going to need to deface three ghost or shadow recruitment posters around the Fortnite map. Now, a couple weeks ago, we saw some super cool ghost and shadow Deadpool posters added into the game files, but at this current time, there's only the normal ghost and shadow ones around the map not the ones with Deadpool on it posters are extremely easy to find all you need to do is go to any little henchman headquarters you know it doesn't even have to be like the grotto or the shark or one of those four corners it can be one of their little secret hideouts along the Fortnite map and at each one of those hideouts there's a bunch of those little posters and that's where you'll have to just deface three of them to complete the second challenge upon completing both of those challenges for week six, you're going to receive the Merc Deadpool wrap for totally free. Overall, I am very, very excited to unlock the Deadpool skin, and I really, really, really hope that Epic Games didn't decide to delay it, even though I could kind of understand why they would even be considering it, because they have been releasing so many challenges. Like, I have so many challenges to complete on Fortnite right now, with the new weekly challenges that just came out. I gotta complete these contract Giller challenges challenges when they hit the item shop in just a couple hours so much to do man so if epic games were to cancel the deadpool challenges now realistically would be the time to do it because we already have our hands full with so
so many other challenges. And there's still one month left in this Fortnite season. The season isn't supposed to end until the very, very last day of April, but let's be honest, Epic Games has delayed literally every single Fortnite season for as long as I can remember. So at this point, I don't even expect it to start on April 30th. I'm gonna say like midway through May is the most realistic start date. But even if the season does end when Epic Games originally says it's gonna end, there's still like four weeks of Deadpool challenges that aren't even gonna be filled if we unlock the skin on week seven. So please, Epic Games, don't let us down, even though I have complete and total faith in you guys, since you guys always blow us out of the water every single time. But I wanna remind you guys, I'm live streaming over on Caffeine three times a week, Sundays, noon to five Central Standard Time, Tuesdays, four to 8.30 Central Standard Time, and then Wednesday, 4.30 to 8.30 as well. It's a ton of fun. I'm always playing Team Rumble with you guys, grinding XP or playing Zone Wars and just trying to improve at the game and get some gameplay for these videos. So come on through to the Caffeine live streams. The link for that will be down in the description. Make an account, follow the Home of Games stream, and your phone will vibrate every time I turn the stream on so you won't miss out on any of it. Also, follow me on Twitter at Home of Games YT for all of the latest and greatest news involving everything Fortnite. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.